The ancestry that brought Indo-European languages to Europe is partly Asian. Eastern European hunter-gatherers are a population who were one half of the ancestors of Yamnaya nomads, famous for being the population that brought Indo-European languages into Europe. It is generally believed that the Indo-European languages, as well as R1 and Q haplogroups in Europe, were brought by them. They have 20 to 25 percent admixture of Western hunter-gatherers who are famously known as the first major inhabitants of Europe, but 75 to 80 percent of their ancestry is from a population called Ancient North Eurasians. This is some of the reconstructions of their appearance. Ancient North Eurasians originated in Siberia and were anywhere between 30 to 50 percent of basal East Eurasian ancestry. They also contributed some ancestry to Siberians and Native Americans, amongst others. Some East Eastern European hunter-gatherers found around Finland have an even additional flow of East Eurasian ancestry, and their reconstructions look like this. This is the reason why some Northeastern Europeans who have high EHG ancestry may appear to have slight Asiatic features. Today, EHG ancestry is found all over Europe, Central Asia, Caucasus, and most of Middle East and South Asia. If you'd like to learn more about other Neolithic populations that contributed to ancestry of modern peoples like this, we have a free guide for you. All you have to do is DM us with a message that says, Hunter, 